The weekend is finally here, and what a perfect time to hit the theaters with your family. Oh, guess who's in the house? Colton Bradford, 95 KSJ's Colton Bradford, joining <laughs> us with your weekend movie preview. You laugh, but I am excited, and so is the, the city, the Gulf Coast, because you do all the legwork. Yes. And then we get to go to the movies. I know. Exciting stuff, right? Yes. And there are tons of good movies in the theaters right now, KJ. Okay. So, so it's for, for the family, for the single folk, for those maybe with Maybe date it. night, whatever yeah. you want to. Yeah. Okay. There's all kinds of stuff in the theaters right now. We'll kick it off with Guardians of the Galaxy. It just came out this summer, and it is the movie of the summer to see. It's rated PG-13. Story is light years from Earth. 26 years after being abducted, Peter Quill finds himself the prime target of a manhunt after discovering an orb wanted by Ronan the Accuser. Pretty it sounds crazy, like right? it's a lot going on there. Like, you <laughs> cannot be late to this movie. Yes, it's got an A-list uh, cast, Chris Pratt, Vin Diesel, Bradley Cooper. So uh, definitely, I think, you know, the guys, it's an action movie, but the ladies, they're probably going to love the fellas Just that are in the movie, too. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Okay, this next one I'm very excited about because I actually have seen this movie. Yeah? All right, yeah. well, we'll have to get your review of it, okay. too. <clears throat> All right, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles just came out this summer as well, rated PG-13. A group of mutated warriors face off against an evil kingpin who wants to take over New York. Stars Megan Fox, Will Arnett, William Fitchner, and... Tons of other A-list actors as well. Yes, awesome, awesome, awesome. I have two kids. Yeah. One's a boy, one's a girl. Sometimes they agree, sometimes they just go the opposite way. Everybody gave us one two thumbs up. Oh yeah, no doubt. It was so cool, I'm especially so from my day. I remember the original. Oh yeah, I remember the uh, the live action one that came out in the '90s too, right? <laughs> Never. I was yeah. all right. Well, yeah. Yeah. I might don't, have been don't go down the age lane, sir. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's next on your movie plate? Let's uh, move over to Lucy. Rated R, a Somebody woman a accidentally caught in a dark field turns the tables on her captors and transforms into a merciless warrior. Since when did you start beyond writing Chinese? This sounds like a hear me roar type of movie. Yes, stars Scarlett Johansson, Morgan Freeman, and Min Sik Choi. Okay. I know. Okay. I had to practice saying that name. I, I let you say it and I just <laughs> smiled. <laughs> moving okay, on but to, you said rated R, yeah? Yes, rated okay. R. Okay, okay. Uh, moving on to Let's Be Cops, also rated R. Very funny movie. I caught it not too long ago. Two struggling pals dress as police officers for a costume party <laughs> and become neighborhood sensations. But when the newly minted heroes get tangled in a real life web of mobsters and dirty detectives, they must put their fake badges on the line. <laughs> How would you rate this one? Uh, I actually, I loved it. I love these kind of movies. And if I could be a fake police officer for an afternoon, you do not want to know what would go down. Oh, that's a whole nother segment. <laughs> that is another segment. Stars okay. Jake Johnson, Damon Wayans Jr. and Rob Riggle. What's next? Uh, Divergent also came out this summer. In a world divided by factions based on virtues, Trist learns she's different and wants to fit in. When she discovers a plot to destroy Divergence, Trist and the Mysterious Four must find out what Divergence dangerous before it's too late. Star Shailene, Woodru Shailene Woodley, Theo James, and Kate Winslet. Mm -hmm. Scary, uh, action-packed? What? Very action-packed. Okay. Yeah, okay. and Shailene Woodley is like the actress to be this summer. She's been oh. in a lot of big summer blockbusters. So she's like the Jennifer Lawrence of this year. Yes. Gotcha. Yes. Okay, before I let you go, you have one more movie you want to preview. Yes, this is perfect for date night. It is The Fault in Our Stars. Okay, Hazel yeah, and Gus are two teenagers who share an acerbic yeah. wit, Just, a disdain for the conventional, and the love that sweeps them on a journey. Who are these people? Like, where do they live? It's based on a book, and their relationship is all the more miraculous, given that Hazel's other constant companion is an oxygen tank. Is an oxygen tank. Gus jokes about his prosthetic leg, and they met and fell in love at a cancer support group. So. See, you love movies like this because I, I smile, but if you can't find love, and happiness or yes. something, yeah. you know? And of course, it also stars Shailene, Shailene Woodley, okay. Ansel Elgort, and Nat Wolf. So Good date night. Yes, great date night. Tons of good movies at the theaters this weekend. If you're looking for something to do with your family, you can always check out what's happening in the theaters at local15tv.com. Just click the entertainment tab. Love it. He did my job. <laughs> we were right back after a quick break. <laughs>